Hello researchers, how are you? I hope you are fine and doing well. In this video, I will be demonstrating how to install Apache Pig programming language on Ubuntu 16.04. Now before we begin with the installation part of Apache Pig on Ubuntu 16.04, let us first of all dive ourselves regarding some introduction and overview of Apache Pig. Apache Pig is a high level platform for creating programs that run on Apache Hadoop. The language for this platform is called Pig Latin. Pig can execute its Hadoop jobs in MapReduce, Apache Tez or Apache Spark. Pig Latin abstracts the programming from the Java MapReduce idiom into a notation which makes MapReduce programming high level similar to that of SQL for RDBMSs. Pig Latin can be extended using user defined functions which the user can write in Java, Python, JavaScript, Ruby or Groovy and then call them directly from the language. If we talk of some more introduction, you can see that why do we need Pig? It is easy to learn especially if you are familiar with SQL. Pig's multi-query approach reduces the number of times data is scanned. This means 1 20th of the lines of code and 1 16th the development time when compared to writing raw MapReduce is being reduced. Performance of the Pig is in par with raw MapReduce. Pig, pro Pig provides data operations like filters, joins, ordering and nested data types like tuples, bags and maps that are missing from MapReduce. Pig Latin is easy to read and write. Why the Pig was created? Pig was originally created by Yahoo in 2006 for researchers to have an ad hoc way of creating and executing MapReduce jobs on very large data sets. It was created to reduce the development time through its multi-query approach. Pig is also created for professionals from non-Java background to make their job easier. Where should Pig be used? Pig can be used under the following scenarios. Number one, when data loads are time sensitive. Number second, when processing various data sources. And number three, which is most important, when analytical insights are required through sampling. Now, where not to use Pig? Number one, in places where the data is completely unstructured like video, audio and readable text. Number two, in places where time constraints exist. For example, pig is slower than map reduce jobs. Number third, in places where more power is required to optimize the codes. Now what are the various applications of Apache Pig? Number one, processing of web logs. Number two, data processing for search patterns. Number three, support for ad hoc queries across large data sets. And number four, quick prototyping of algorithms for processing large data sets. How Yahoo uses Pig? Yahoo uses Pig for the following purposes. Number one, in pipelines to bring logs from its web servers where these logs undergo a cleaning step to remove bots, company interview interval, uh, interval views and clicks. In research, to quickly write a script to test a theory, Pig integration makes it easier for researchers to take a Perl or Python script and run it against a huge data set. Now, if we, if we find the broad structure, program structure of Pig, it consists of the hierarchy of three things. Number one, script. Number two, grunt. And number three, embedded. So, the script which is defined as Pig can run a script file that contains Pig commands. For example, pig script.pig run the command in the local file script.pig. Grunt, it is an interactive shell for running Pig commands, which I will be demonstrating how to install and we will be coming on the grunt prompt uh, afterwards in this video. It is also possible to run pig scripts from within the grunt from using run and executable commands. And number three, which is embedded, can run pig programs from Java, much like you use JDBC or run SQL programs from Java. So if we found of the pig Latin program, what is it? Pig Latin program is made of series of operations or transformations that are applied to input data to produce output. The job of pig is to convert the transformations in a series of map reduce jobs. Now, PIC comprise of four basic types of data models. Number one, atom. It is a simple atom data value, that is a string or a number. Tuple, an ordered set of fields. Number third, a bag, a collection of tuples. And number four, map set of key value pairs. So this was regarding some basic introduction of Apache PIG. Now, I have already opened the official website. You can see the, uh, the, uh, the Apache PIG, that is pig.apache.org. 
as you can know that it was initial release it was done on September 11 2008 about eight years ago and the stable release which we are using in this video even that is Apache Pig 0.16.0 which was released on June 8 2016 about four months ago it is cross-platform which means that it can be operated on Windows OS X and even on Linux and it is under Apache license 2.0 so if you want to download Apache Pig, you can just click over here and you can find all the release pages, all the contributions and all the developments and documentations all is over here. So you can find more things over the releases and you can even find more information over here. So if you click on this download a release now, you can just click over here and you can go over there that is pig to a 0.16.0 so download this file that is tar.gz which will we be using don't use source.tar.gz it is open source because the source code is there so you can see that I have already downloaded it on my desktop so if I right click over here it is about you can say 169 MB so what we have to do we can just go to Ubuntu 16.04 and we first of all we just copy and then I will be demonstrating how to start pick so let us copy this into our VMware machine so let us give the password and let us paste it so it will be pasted on our desktop you can see let it paste it so you can see that it is pasted on the desktop now before I start with the the installation part of Apache pig let me make it sure with you that what are the prerequisite installations number one is that that your machine should be Ubuntu 16.04 why I am using Ubuntu 16.04 because it is more stable as compared to any other distribution it is very light and secondly I am able to run each and every command of Apache pig very beautifully using Ubuntu 16.04 the second thing is called that is Java so how to install Java I have already demonstrated in lots of my videos and even when I have demonstrated how to install Apache Hadoop and the third which is very important that is Hadoop itself that is 2.7.0 and the link how how to install Apache Hadoop is available downstairs of this video you can just click over here you can watch my video and then you can start with the installation so make it sure that your operating system should be Ubuntu 16.04 you have installed Java and you must have installed Hadoop now before we go with the installation of Apache Pig what we have to do is to start the Apache Hadoop because suppose that if you don't start Apache Hadoop if you don't do the JPS command the pig will not be installed properly so what we have to do we have to first of all start the SSH service that is service SSH D restart so let me give you the password of root because we are in the simple user because this user itself you can find in my video is being used in order to install Apache Hadoop so what we have to go is to restart the Apache Hadoop so let us go to this uh, folder CD slash user slash local slash Apache slash Hadoop so CD Hadoop 2.7.0 so what we have to do is to go to this folder that is SPIN and now you can find that there is a command that is start all dot sh so what you have to do is to give this command dot slash start hyphen all dot sh so this will start the entire Hadoop in this uh, uh, machine so even if you have installed Hadoop you have shut down the machine or restarted the machine go for this command only with the user which you have used in order to install Hadoop and then everything will be okay so you can see that the name node has been started and data node has been started on localhost after starting Hadoop we will be starting with our next operations so secondary name nodes are being started so it will take some time because we, the machine is being restarted and it's a fresh machine which has been installed with Ubuntu and only Java and Hadoop so you can see that it has been started so give this command JPS to start the processes so all the process has been started so now this machine is fully compatible to start the installation of Apache Pig now in order to download I have already given you the link or oh, this is the link also which will be available downstairs you can just download the pig 0.16 and even if in the future the latest versions come what you have to do is to just replace these versions over here rest all of these steps will remain the same okay so let us go to this desktop so that we can start with the procedure of pig 
So let us go to desktop. Now what we have to do is to extract the contents of the pig tar.gz file. So give this command tar minus xvf pig this file, this enter. So the whole of the pig uh, contents will be extracted. Okay, so now you can see that there are two folders that is, uh, sorry, there will be one folder that is a pig folder and there is a file that is pig file. So what we have to do is to make one directory. So sudo mkdir space slash user slash lib slash pig. So I will be copying the pig folder to this location. So what we have to do is to move the pig location that is sudo move pig to slash user slash lib slash pig slash so it has been done so now what we have to do is to go to this folder now cd slash user slash lib slash pig so this is the folder so cd pig and over here we can find the files so what we have to do is to edit one uh, path for the bash rc so nano bash rc slash dot bash rc so you can find in the end I have already used this Hadoop and even the HBase over here. So what we have to do is to add these two files. So copy them and let's paste them. So let us press Ctrl X, yes and press enter. So after that what we have to do is to give this command source bash rc so that everything gets merged up. So it has been merged up. So now what we have to do is to give the command that is so the pig has been installed so pig space minus h so this completes the installation of pig so you can see that the pig has been installed and pig is there so let us uh, go with some more commands that is pig space minus x local grunt So the pig will be started in the local grunt. So let us start the pig in the map reduce part. So pig space minus x map reduce. So you can find the grunt over here. So you have to just write the quit word. So in order to quit, so let us go again with this command that is pig space minus x local. So it will start with the local. So you can see that everything is there. So again quit. So if we start even with pig, it will be started. So you can see that how much easy it is to install pig. And in the coming videos, in the coming months, I will be making more videos on how to do some operations of tables, how to insert, create the table. And uh, even I will be also researching uh, and bringing you all that how to have some front end web based interface of pig, which is right now not available in the coming future so that we can be able to operate our pig commands over uh, the front end interface via some website interface or as some content management system. So in this video, I have demonstrated how to install Apache pig and it is very easy to install so do give this a shot do like this video do share with your friends thank you so much for watching